Hey everybody, this is a little update on the uh, scale build of gentleman build I got going on. Yeah, I started another one. Uh, this one here will be a little bit quicker, I think. Kind of still just as fun though. Uh, that is the little four cylinder and the body out of that uh, Beverly Hillbillies thing. I think somebody said it was an old or something like that. It's just a goofy uh, body. It's narrow and goes really wide. So I thought that would be a cool little cool little sand uh, frog car there. Did some lightning holes in this uh, turtle deck. I don't know what that's from. But it looks pretty good behind there. The frame. I don't know what it's from. Uh, old Revell, uh 20 some. I don't know. But it's working the wire wheels and everything just uh just fighting around with this one so uh we'll see where it goes uh real quick though i want to give some channel shout outs to these guys here over here on the side i got their subs and their videos and uh this guy here i think he's just starting out uh michael scale models uh, six subs and four videos. So he definitely needs uh, some loving and some subbing and some liking and sharing. And we got uh, Buzz Dennis. I guess that's how you say his name. 127 subs. I think that's eight videos. And uh, Richie Speech Up, I might have mentioned before. I'm not sure. But that's 118 and 23 videos. So all these guys need some love. We got Law Scale Customs. I just uh, channel shouted out at him, but he still needs some more love, and it's a good channel. Uh, all these guys have great channels and uh, lots of cool stuff. They just uh, need a little encouragement. And then we got the Canadian Modelers. He's uh, he's getting up there. He's got 202, 13 videos, and 125 rods. I've mentioned him a few times. Uh, he's got some really good stuff, and uh, he's doing all kinds of stuff, uh, trying new stuff and just having fun. So we need to give him some more love, get them uh, subs up there a little bit. He's doing good on the videos, just need some more subs. So anyway, these guys, uh, if you haven't uh, subbed them or watched any other videos yet, go give them a. Go give them a view and uh, give them a shout out and give them a sub and all that good stuff. Real good, real good channels, real good guys. So uh, go uh, go check them out. See what you guys think. Anyway, uh, the other one I've uh, been working on, I took a little break, the 29. But I spent like hours and hours weathering this thing. I'm not a professional like, uh, oh crap. Like, well, like a lot of you guys out there that do this, it's kind of, I'm not too good at it. So what I did is, uh, after hours and hours of working on it, I'm just leaving it like that. That's like a, uh, barn find real car. That's a bag find, uh, box find, uh, 29 body. And instead of trying to mess around and replicate some uh, wear and tear on it, I'm just leaving it like that. Got the panels inside there. I painted the seat the uh, uh, brown uh, primer color. And I got a little roll bar there. Just a little hoop. I've seen a lot of that on some of them. Got the front end on there. Uh, with the fins, I couldn't get those fenders off, so I hope they're all right. But I wanted those wheels to go with those back wheels there. Beat up old white walls, and then uh, wait, and I got some lightning holes in this, and down there in the frame too. And I got some along there, but uh, the body sits down a little bit, so you can't see them from this side. But we opened up the trunk. And we got the little fuel cell in there in the battery, not the best lighting. Got some plumbing and some wiring going on in there. And the hood works pretty good, or the deck, but I'm, I'm surprised. I haven't done that in forever. 
So anyway, let's see. Uh, I got the steering and stuff I still got to do. Uh, it's part of it right there. It's going to come out the side here and then go down. So the steering rod's going to go down in and go into that and then come out the side. Haven't decided on the heads and the manifold yet. Uh, I don't know which way I'm going. And this, I put some black uh, whoa, decal gauges in there and you couldn't see them. So now I got to try and and uh, scratch them all out of there and figure something else out or change change uh, instrument panels change the dash i don't know yet but so uh, next up on this thing i just gotta get the engine motor going got the manifolds there and the pull there's a steering wheel and stuff i got the the body's not it kind of slides down on there but it's not glued on but then we did some work on the chassis here let everything fall out uh, we did some brake lines and fuel lines and a battery cable going up to the starter there got the front brake lines and little uh, pieces of aluminum to look like fittings and stuff got the rear brake line there no uh, no real aftermarket stuff uh, I don't have a lot of it left so but you can't really see up in there. There you go. So I just use plastic and metal tubing to make it look like fittings and brackets and stuff like that. Brake lines going into the rear axle there. So anyway, that's where we're at with this. There's the uh, back uh, panel there. And I should get rid of a little bit of that gap there when I glue the body down better. But let's see, there's my big hand there. I got the brake line going across. I got to run the lines from the from the tire over here to the little uh, fitting block things there where it breaks it up. So anyway, having fun. Uh, yeah, I'm just going to leave that body like that. It's uh, got to look like the guy found it out in the, out in the field or buried in a barn. And he's just going to throw it on the frame and go uh, do some sand dragging with it. And we'll uh, paint it later type of thing. So anyway, that's where we're at with that. And that one. So having fun. Man, some of you guys got some awesome stuff going on out there. So looking forward to seeing some of this stuff done. Man, I wish I would have found that gas tank. Before I put that one in there, that's perfect. Look, that was with that uh, Beverly Hillbillies thing. Just cut the frame and got the rest of it out. But oh well, I'll put it somewhere. I might put that nose on here too. I don't know. Anyway, I'm out here. Thanks for watching, guys. Keep doing those updates on your stuff out there because it's awesome, awesome stuff. So, anyway, take care. Thanks for subbing, everybody. And we'll talk at you all later. Bye.